Diabetes can affect the small blood vessels located in the back of the eye. The walls of these blood vessels can become weak leading to an aneurysm. An aneurysm is very fragile and can bleed or cause fluid to leak into the retina, the tissue which contains light sensitive cells in the back of the eye. Fluid leakage at the center of the macula can lead to diabetic macular edema. Patients may then notice distortion and loss of vision. To treat diabetic macular edema involving the center of the macula, a small needle is inserted into the vitreous, the jelly portion of the eye. Anti-VGF medication is then injected, which will diffuse through the vitreous and into the retina. Here, the medication binds to VGF, blocking the signal that causes blood vessels to leak. With repeated injections, the fluid dries up and vision improves.